G'day all. I've got a, um, a new firmware which I came across for the Mavic. Uh, it's not something I kind of, I don't really want to promote too much because it's, um, it, it, it gets rid of the altitude height, but it's something I wanted to try. I've had a few instances in my, in my times with the Mavic where I can be stuck if you can't go up over 500 meters, for instance, if you accidentally fly, fly at altitude around mountains and you're and you uh, pass behind something that's more than 500 meters in height and it kicks the return to home in uh, you're basically not going to stand much of a chance of it coming back to you so partly that's part of the reason why I thought that I'd give this a go because it's um it it sky's the limit basically with it so I thought I just wanted to test it now where I'm testing it it's in uh, the back area where we are here there is uh, it's it's away from houses it's up in the mountains we're going and it's it's far from any helipads airports planes don't fly around here so it's done in fairly uh, safe conditions here and so I don't recommend flying at these altitudes it is legal but it's just something I wanted to test I'm gonna be wearing my DJI goggles another thing I wanted to test was the range on these goggles I've never really done before so that's something I want to do um, and basically yeah it's a bit of a range test I guess for the Mavic 2 in some ways um, I've seen them go a lot quite far uh, I'm not going to try and beat anything like that because you've got the battery that's your biggest concern to get back safely so hope you enjoy the video and we'll uh, catch up with you a bit later Down below there is um, Isabella Falls. I've actually flown to there before as well, up to the falls. It's not, not a lot of water there at the moment, so you can't really see too much, but that rock face there is uh, a waterfall. And this flight I'm gonna be doing all purely through the Go app. Um, it's not uh, from the SD card, it's a screen recording. Uh, just keep an eye, the new firmware that I've put on, it's a modified firmware, I'm not going to give any links or nothing, I'll let you do your own digging if you want to source that, but uh, it also unlocks Galileo satellites, so with this firmware it's allowing us to add extra satellites uh, to the current satellites the Mavic and other craft of DJI's pick up in their factory form which is why we're getting up, I'm getting up to 30 satellites now. Definite big advantage with this firmware. So keep an eye on the amount of satellites I get as well as the height um, limitations. I've got my height restrictions set to 120 meters just to show you it overrides it all. So currently we're at 600 meters or just over 600 meters and rising. And I'm gonna fast forward the video now quite considerably just to get us up near the top. And then we'll have a look. Battery level is low, the aircraft will go to the home point in 10 seconds. Alright, we're pretty much approaching as far as I want to go with this. It's battery levels, I don't want to risk at all getting back with low battery. So, return to home just kicked in, uh, which I've cancelled. So, I just want to get up to about a thousand metres. So we're close to the peak. You can see over the back of the table ends.
bins around. Uh, the, that's a, our, our dam, the Coppolo Dam. And um, we spin around further, you can see uh, the city and everything below. It's a long way up. So it's pretty good. I've got good range right the way through. The goggles haven't faulted right from the start. So I've gone out 2.6 2, 2 kilometers and up one kilometre and the goggles have been just fantastic they, they haven't done they haven't glitched at all all that way uh, good range on the Mavic as well uh, satellites are up at 29 like I said that the new firmware has unlocked the Galileo satellites so I've got 29 satellites good good accuracy and um, yeah very happy with it so we'll turn back around I'll head back now I'll speed it back up again See you when I get back. Go home. And like I said earlier, this test, it's not something I'm going to be doing often going up these heights. It's like I say, I, I always like the height restrict, unrestricted height just for the fact if you accidentally fly behind something like a mountain, especially in mountainous areas, you, your return to home kicks in you're um, going to be in trouble because the craft can't get up above 500 meters if it needs to at least this way it, it can and you've got more of a chance of it coming back safely but just always got to remember it's uh it is illegal to get up that height especially over cities and over populated areas so keep that in mind anyway i hope you enjoyed the video i'm back down now and um, all was safe. I'm very happy with the firmware. I will not be updating it anymore. This is how I love the, 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 the craft um, Especially the satellites and uh, Yeah, happy days. Have a good one. Catch us next time <laughs>